Basic instincts. Examples. Bacteria. Tiny organisms. These tiny beings simply respond to things like light, food, or temperature. They aren't thinking. They just act in pure survival mode. Condition reflexes. Examples. Insects like ants or bees. They learn simple associations, like light means food or danger means hide. It isn't deep thinking, but it's enough to keep them alive. Pattern recognition. Examples fish, reptiles. These animals recognize patterns, like where to find food or how to avoid predators. It's simple, but it helps them survive. Sensory motor skills. Examples birds, small mammals like mice. They use their senses to explore, move around, and solve simple problems by trial and error. In short, they know how to navigate their world and get things done. Social intelligence. Examples, wolves, dolphins, monkeys. These animals can recognize their group members, communicate, and form social hierarchies. They understand group dynamics, which helps them hunt together or raise their young. They also show loyalty and create bonds that help them survive. Imitation. Examples. Apes, crows, parrots. These animals observe and copy the actions of others to learn new skills. For example, a young monkey might watch its mother use a stick to get termites and then try it for itself. Imitation is key for learning and helps them acquire skills necessary for survival and social life. Conceptual intelligence. Examples. Apes, dolphins. At this level, animals begin to understand more complex ideas like numbers or symbols. They can follow commands and solve basic problems. Some dolphins, for instance, can perform tricks on cue or communicate using symbols. Empathy. Examples. Elephants. Some animals show empathy, meaning they can understand and respond to others' emotions. Elephants often comfort a distressed friend or even mourn their dead. This emotional intelligence is important for building strong social bonds and keeping their groups healthy. Human-level intelligence. At this level, we're talking about humans. We have advanced reasoning, creativity, problem-solving skills, and can think about abstract concepts. We create complex languages, build technologies, and ponder deep philosophical questions. Enhanced human intelligence. This is when humans use technology to enhance their cognitive abilities. Imagine people with brain implants to improve memory or augmented reality devices that provide real-time information. Artificial narrow intelligence, AI. This type of AI is designed for specific tasks like Siri, chess playing computers, or facial recognition. AI excels at one thing, like beating humans at chess or identifying faces in photos, but can't reason or think beyond its specific purpose. Artificial creative intelligence. AI that not only solves problems, but also creates things like art, music, or literature. Artificial superintelligence, ASI. ASI refers to an AI that is more intelligent than humans in every way. It could solve complex global problems, innovate faster than we could imagine, and possibly even improve itself. Planetary intelligence. This idea suggests that all living things, ecosystems, and technology on Earth combine to form a single connected intelligence. This Earth brain would respond to global challenges by using the collective knowledge and abilities of all life forms on the planet. Interplanetary Intelligence Imagine a system that connects and coordinates efforts across multiple planets, involving humans, aliens, and AI to explore and colonize different worlds. Galactic Intelligence this level involves intelligence that spans an entire galaxy, managing resources, star systems, and possibly multiple civilizations. Multiversal Intelligence A hypothetical type of intelligence that exists across multiple universes, interacting with and understanding different realities, dimensions, and the laws that govern them. 